Could you be starving your immune system, leading to an autoimmune condition that's affecting as much as one in six individuals in the developed countries? There are three nutrients that are so well studied by science that have shown to be vitally important for our immune system function. And what's cool is that each of these are easily measure, measured and easily managed either through diet or through supplementation. Now, the first nutrient is vitamin D. And I can tell you there are thousands of papers that associate low vitamin D levels with autoimmune processes, namely things like multiple sclerosis. So be sure to measure your vitamin D and ensure that your level is between somewhere like 60 and 80, which is kind of the sweet spot for vitamin D. Now, the next important nutrient is zinc. Now, zinc interfaces with our immune system in a number of places, things like zinc fingers and zinc binding regions and zinc globules. But suffice to say that the World Health Organization estimates Estimate that something like 25% of the world is zinc deficient. So what's your zinc level? And the last nutrient that so many people are deficient in are the omega-3 fats. These are the anti-inflammatory fats that are found in things like fish oils. It's really important to know what your omega-3 to omega-6 or arachidonic acid ratios are, because as we get into lower ratios and lower percentages of these vital fats in our cell membranes, our immune system doesn't work so well. So, so there are three nutrients that are associated with your immune system function. And if you guys want to know more, about the way that your immune system works, how autoimmunity develops, I'd recommend that you meet me in a video which is listed in the description below. And uh, we do a soup to nuts review of all of these things and I hope to see you there. All right, take care.